Hi, I'm Carles. And I'm Tony. We are from Spain. Welcome to Candy. Noon right now, we just arrived in Kendi and uh, Tarindu, our amazing driver, he uh, opened a restaurant uh, recently here in town and since it's time for lunch, uh, we decided to go visit the restaurant and have an amazing lunch there. Hi! 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 Oh my god! You have a beautiful view! Yeah! Thank you so much! Okay. We're really high and this wind is just killing me with my hair. It's a tiny piece of paradise here. It's really hectic in the streets. Um, once you get up there, it's so calm and peaceful and nice. I think the highest building here, if you don't consider like, you know, the one on the mountain. I feel kotu it's like little rice, um, flat noodles, cut in little pieces, which is my favorite meals in Malaysia and everywhere else. <laughs> so, just with chicken. Mm. Very good. It has eggs in it, and vegetables, and cabbage, and the chicken. It's um, already cooked and then uh, shredded inside. Very good. And now let's try mine. This is a recommendation from Tarindu. It's a cheese coat too, I think. The perfect comfort meal if you feel, you know, far from home. Sri Lankan version of a mac and cheese with chicken inside. So delicious, eh? Mm. Portion are really huge. Plus, you have a super nice view. Look at this. Oh my god, we're so full right now. Yeah, we had such a good lunch. Yeah. Now we're gonna head to our Airbnb and uh, hopefully check out a little bit of candy and to see maybe the temple of the tooth. It's supposed to host the actual tooth of Buddha. Thank you, Therindu. The best guy. I'll give you guys his information also. Yeah, the best driver. Thank Bye, you very okay. much. Thank you so much for receiving us. It Thank is you. very delicious, the food that you cooked. Thank you. Again, sure, and sure. God bless you. Oh, it's buzzing around here. Like you hear all the honk honk from the car. Watch out, the tuk tuk. It's raining like Sri Lankan rain. So I'm gonna put my DSLR in the bag before I lose it. So we're heading to a hotel, Jay, you sure? It's supposedly. Hello. All right. <laughs> Goodbye, Tarendu. Thank Goodbye. you for the day. You were very generous with us. Thank you for inviting us at the restaurant also. Okay. It's very nice. <laughs> You're welcome. Bye. Bye, Bye. Thank you so much. this outside. I know, it's and so cool. Eh? Yeah, Thank you very much. Yeah. We're really happy with the room. Yeah. And now, we're ready to explore a temple. 
But first, we have to take that welcome drink. Everything has so much character here in Kendi. I really like it and there's so many different choices of places. Um, but I fell in love with this one on Airbnb. And you cannot book this hotel um, without Airbnb. It's only on Airbnb. Uh, they say all the bookings. So if you guys have never used Airbnb, we do have a referral link in the description box and you can benefit from um, $45, 45. Yeah. rebate for your first booking. So use it if you haven't already. Wow, look at all the house and the plants decorating it. It's so beautiful. Really, really nice. Yeah, I would pay someone in Canada to do something like this and it's not possible. Oh, Hello. and here's our tuk-tuk. Hi! Hi! Nice to meet you, sir. We just arrived at the two temple uh, at the entrance. So we're gonna walk around and visit a little bit. Apparently there are uh, religious ceremony several times during the day, I think at 10. And I know the closest to us right now is 6.30, so I don't know if we're still gonna be around the temple at that time, but if we do, uh, just keep in mind this is a very sacred Buddhist temple uh, because he actually has the two for Buddha. Um, so for men, it's the shorts are not allowed at all. You do need a three-quarter pants or full pants. You're gonna be required to walk around barefoot. So don't wear running shoes or anything because sometimes it's rainy here, so the ground is wet. So you're wearing rain, uh, running shoes and you have socks on. It can be kind of disgusting when you have to put them back on. Just got a ticket at those machines over there. It's like an ATM. You punch in the number of tickets you want, um, and for us, it's uh, fifteen hundred. Uh, per person, so it's 3000 for the two of us, but there are different prices if you're from Thailand, Myanmar, or if you're local. Alright, sorry for the wait, we were just setting up, you know. Barefoot. The tooth is actually in a uh, jewel piece that you see on the board over there. It's like all in gold with gems and uh, diamonds offered by other countries. And they put this thing inside of the shrine that's right here where people are putting all the flowers and everything in front of. So apparently the gold door you see over there that are closed that are uh, hiding the tooth relic. They're open three times a day, morning, at noon, and uh, in the evening. So that's a ceremony. They open it for 15 minutes, and people can bring the offering uh, and circle around the terrace section over here. But they cannot stop. They can like pass by the door and have one look at the tooth relic and continue their way. Take a look at this one guys, it's been declared as a national treasure, it used to serve the king. Wow, this temple, it's incredible, like it's the, really nice. yeah, the attention pay to the small details, the engraving that they put, you know, on the statue, on the wood, on the floor. Everything, it's like, wow, mind-blowing. I'm really happy we came here. Some visitors, you know, when they give the offerings, they put the, the flowers facing the statue and not, you know, heading any other ways. Just, you know, the, the amount of respect that they pay to Buddha. Come here, be very careful. You're not supposed to take selfies um, with Buddhas. And uh, it's taken in a very large uh, sense that you're not supposed to be uh, having any picture of you and Buddha in the same picture so if you come here uh, pay a lot of attention to that because you're gonna be you're gonna be uh, yeah they yell at you <laughs> by people here <laughs>
We're heading back to the Airbnb. Uh, we ordered supper at 8 on the terrace. So hopefully there's going to be enough light for us to show you guys. We'll see you later. Thank you. Thank you. Our, our Airbnb offers uh, the supper options for 6 uh, US each and uh, we decided to take it so, so we can eat with a beautiful view here on the top of the mountain and uh, so it's a traditional Sri Lankan meal here with rotis, some coconut uh, sambal, dal curry and uh, it comes with a choice of meat so Takio took some beef, I took some chicken. Um, it's quite traditional and uh, we love it. It's really good. Look at the view guys. Yeah, that's why that we is decided insane. to eat here. You could probably eat in town for uh, about half of that price but uh, we just decided to come here anyway and enjoy the view at the same time. Mm. Really spicy, Jade. You will be really happy. Mm. Pepper! Pepper! This is Pepper! pepper. Oh. <laughs> can we can we bring it back to the room? <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> hey, this is Pepe. If you like my cute face, please click on the like button and leave me a comment to tell me how cute you think I am. And you haven't already, subscribe to this channel. Bye!